Word. The Holocaust happened more than 75 years ago. It's important history to most of us, but for a select few, it's vivid memory. KCTV5's Leslie Aguilar spoke with a Holocaust survivor who's part of a temporary exhibit right now at the Liberty Memorial. Right now, there are about 50 Holocaust survivors living in the Kansas City Metro. Seven of them are featured in this exhibit called Lest We Forget. A picture can tell a story, and the subject of this one has an important story to tell. I think I may be an example of having thwarted Hitler's goals. Judy Gondos Jacobs lives in Overland Park, but she's from Hungary. She was only seven when Nazis took over and sent her and her parents to a concentration camp. Bergen Belton was just sheer hell. There's no other way to describe it. Her upper middle class parents were well off before the war. Her dad a physician, her mother an interior designer. None of that mattered to the Nazis. We were constantly barraged with insults, verbal insults. You dirty, filthy Jews, you don't deserve to live, you're subhumans, that sort of thing. Jacob says there were no gas chambers at this camp, but people still died of starvation or disease. Nobody had any energy. They just lay on their bunks in apathy, staring at the ceiling. Her parents made sacrifices to keep her alive, like trading in their small 350 calorie daily ration for a piece of an old blanket. And they would roll me up in it and safety pin it. And that's how I went outside to roll call because I had no coat. Jacob's picture and the others are already doing what they're meant to do make people feel something. The amazing resilience that some of them portray just by the look on their face. This woman will be bringing friends here to share these stories. Jacobs will tell hers until she can't anymore. I consider it an obligation, actually a sacred obligation, to teach the world the depravity to which mankind can sink. Because lest we forget, it could happen again. The exhibit will be up until October 6th, but tomorrow at noon, the artist Luigi Toscano will be here giving guided tours of the exhibit. Judy Jacobs and the other Kansas City survivors featured will be here as well. In Kansas City, Leslie Aguilar, KCTV 5 News.